Hi friends, today we are going to talk about a very important topic that in SAP everything is integrated is called the time zone piece. So everywhere you have, you know, the daylight saving and all those things in Europe, in US, in South America and Brazil, I think they have stopped, but in US and UK, in US and in Europe, it very much happens. So this is the different types of tables that are associated with time zone. Okay, so whenever you search, you have to go with TTZ star and you get so out of which some of the very important tables are uh, this. Okay, so here you can see TTSDF. If I go and if I search with US, okay, and here I can get all the information. So from 2007, from third uh, starting month is third month. If you see and uh, this this time zone changes and it stops at a different time. Uh, it has a different time zone, okay? So here you can get all this information, like uh, there are other tables also we, we can see. We'll just go through each of these tables. TB, uh, I think the another very important table is TTZZ. So let's see if we can go TTZZ. Here you can get all the information of the different time zones. Okay, so here you can see for uh, if you go for time zone. So let me see. Mm, let me go and here you can see plus four and a half difference from uh, from different time zones have different times. Okay, so here you can see plus ten. I think it's UTC. I don't remember what is UTC. Universal time something. I don't know. So Europe. Uh, if you see Bangladesh plus six hours. If you go to Brazil, it's minus five hours. I think it's the GMT, Greenwich Mean Time. Okay, so these are the different rules you have. So let's go, if I go, so here if you change, so if someone logs into India, yeah, it's five and a half hours. If someone logs no light, daylight saving, and here you see all the different, where there is daylight saving, North America, you have different minus six hours. USA have minus six, see? You have different time zones. It's it's very much. You must be thinking, oh, everything should be done automatically. So here is all the all the innovation that happens. Okay. So you have all these tables which which is maintained. So if you see, this is the mean mean time. So plus one hour. So based on this, the time is calculated. Okay. So and when when the time comes on a particular date, like when. Uh, U.S. goes into November, then the time changes, and when it goes to March, some date, it, the time changes. So you can see, it doesn't happen automatically. Like if the rules changes, you have to update these rules. Okay, so this is very important. Uh, let's see some other tables, but which we have summer time rules. Let's see, TTZDF. Let's see this one. I don't know. We can go and check TTZD. And you can see daylight saving rules. Here you have different rules. And so this is see different. This is this this is the summertime, one hour difference. And let's see Z, there was another table, ZDF. So let's see daylight saving rules. Uh, if I go, so you have different rules here. If you see uh, you have some different rules for Israel and all those things. So you can see when the time really changed and all those things. Okay, so this is very really pretty nice. What other tables are there? Let's see, TTZZT. That's probably a T T table rule text. Okay, customizing time zone. Let's see this one. Customizing TTZCU. Okay, let's see this one. TTZCU. Okay, and here you can see the system time. And you here you can change so it's nothing special. TTZZT is probably a, a text table, and here you can see the language. Uh, you have diff different. So if I search with EN, and here you get all the language related stuff. So here you can see if I click on this, I get more information. Okay, so this is very important. So that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning. And if you like it, share it and subscribe to it. Thank you and have a great day.